Neil, a 2-1 win away from home. How, how, how um, pleased are you with that performance? I'm very pleased with the performance. Uh, obviously pleased with the result. Um, pleased just with the attitude of the players because they've had a difficult week. Um, I was pleased with, with what they did on Tuesday night. Um, in difficult circumstances with the two men getting sent off and a lot of those players have obviously played again today and um, so they've had a really tough week and uh, they came through it they say exceptionally well How good a performance was it given the fact that as you say you had to make make changes following a Tuesday night's defeat? Uh, I think in the context, context of the week we've had it was a you know, an excellent win because I think Carlisle, well I don't think they're a good team they've got good players um, so you know you're going if you come here and win you're gonna have to you know you're gonna have to to do a good job and uh, I thought the first 30 minutes of the game we got pushed back we never really showed anything as an attacking force came into the game better towards half time and then obviously we started the second half really well and um, that gave us a little bit of a cushion which we needed at the end because they put us under pressure and obviously when they get the goal back it's it, it's a nervous time at the end, but the players have dug in, and, and I'm really, really pleased with with their attitude. And just how important a win was it, given in your next run of fixtures through through the festive period? Yeah, I think the I think we've got some really tough fixtures uh, when you look through the through the the games that we have, and this was going to be a tough. Well, it was a tough fixture, so it's absolutely vital that we got some points on the board going into this period. Um, It'll give the players a lot of confidence, but as I say, we're in for a well. We're in, every game is going to be a battle from now to the end of the season, but but certainly the fixtures over Christmas are going to be tough, especially where there's been a couple of players down. Tyrone Barnett came on and made an instant impact score on the first goal. Was that was that a moment of tactical genius there on your part, or was it an, an, another forced uh, change? No, no. I think when when they come off, it's always tactical genius, and uh, when they don't, then obviously there must be some other reason for it. But uh, um, no, I decided that I wanted to get another forward on because I felt we could exploit them at the back if we put them under a little bit more pressure. And you know, it's always nice when it comes off. But it, he did do well, Tyrone. Uh, it's great for him to get a goal, but um, as long as he works hard and he's committed and he puts himself about, then then that's all I ask of him. As you say, it's good for him to get a, to get a goal as well as first league goal in a Vale shirt. Just how important is that for for Tyrone's confidence? Well, any striker wants to get off the mark if he comes to a new club, and um, you know now he's done that. Let's hope he gets some more goals between now and the end of the season. And finally, just a quick word on the fans. They tra they travelled here in great voice again today. Well, I mean, it's uh, when you, when you think there's the, there'll be some of the same supporters who got, went all the way down to Yeovil and had the disappointment of that game, and then they've come all the way up to Carlisle, and let us say they've not had much to cheer about this season. So I'm I'm really pleased for them. To give the, the team good support and um, like I've said when I first took over everybody's got to stick together there's going to be some games where we don't get the result we want but uh, you know if everybody does that then it gives us a, ch a fighting chance to get out of trouble